Hey everybody, my name is Ivica, thank you so much for joining me on my latest Roblox Studio beginner tutorial that will show you how you can insert any item using its catalog ID in your Roblox game. To do that, we're going to use a really simple script, I'm going to show it now, and we're going to see what happens once we do. So first thing is first, you need to have under your view options, your command bar active. As you can see, it's right here and the command bar is here. Now I already have written the same script, which is this game, get service, insert service, load asset. And this is the important element. This is the asset ID. So you need to find the right ID, wherever you're finding your assets and then parent equals game. And finally, this is the place you want your asset to be created. In this case, it's workspace and it can be something else, but I'm using it as a workspace, but you can easily add either a starter player or something else. Now, this is the tricky element. I have this item, which is a fedora with a rainbow colored bandana. Once I hit enter, absolutely nothing happens. However, in my workspace, I have the model right here. So when I go and play the game, I enter the match, I can see in this case two of my fedoras got spanned, spawned and they're here but this is the model itself. So the model is here and I can now use it, manipulate it. I just need to understand that it's spawned here. If I delete one and then re-enter the game, I'm going to see just a single fedora here and it's basically in your game. So that's the entire process. You're just using the command bar, this short script, you can find it in the description below. And don't forget, this is the important thing, the asset ID, item ID that you want to have in your game. If it's valid, it's going to be green. Otherwise, you're probably not able to use it or get it into your game. There it is, pretty simple, really straightforward, really easy, open to then further edits and everything else when you use the actual model here but that's the essence of it so thanks a lot for watching if you'd like to support me please subscribe be here for my new clips otherwise please check out my patreon page please check out my channel memberships please check out my books on amazon all of those if you check them out or decide to join or buy really help out my channel thanks a lot again for watching don't forget the cheapest easiest fastest way to support me leave a like Subscribe and be here for my new clips. That's all for me. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a great day. Have a lot of fun in your Roblox adventures and I'll see you on my next tutorial. Until then, bye bye.